this tutorial we are going to learn how to configure microsoft outlook 2010 with your gmail account so first of all login with your gmail account and uh, password to gmail.com then after log after login click here and uh, go to setting then click on forwarding and pop a tab then uh, i am ap access enable this feature okay by default it is disabled so we have to enable it then click on save change after that go to start button then open your outlook outlook microsoft outlook it will look like this okay so then click on next button yes next we are going to configure it configure it manually so just select here this one manually configure okay then click on next internet email click next then write your full name like i am going to write here then your gmail address this gmail address okay which one you want to configure okay so set the rate gmail.com okay then change your account type to i am ap then now you need to fill these two things which is incoming mail server and outgoing mail server if you don't know what you have <coughs> need to write here and simply click here go to setting and uh, then i am then click on forwarding then here you will see configure instruction actually google i gave us a tutorial about configuring uh, the outlook but we never studied about this so just I want to enable its outlook and here you can see okay so here it is incoming mail server you have to write there i am ap at the uh, sorry i am ap dot gmail dot com so let's incoming server should be i am ap dot gmail dot com okay and uh, outgoing mail server should be smtp smtp dot gmail dot com okay then your uh, username should be your full email id like here geeky shows at the rate gmail.com and your gmail password okay then you need to click here more setting and go to outgoing server and check this box which is saying that my outgoing server smtp require authentication okay then go to advanced tab and uh, incoming server port number should be 993 okay so just write 993 and outgoing server smtp port should be 465 so just write it 65 <coughs> and change the encrypt connection type ssl ssl 
okay six five okay then click okay button and click here to test your account setting it is uh, as you can see here completed and uh, it should be completed so here it is so status is showing that everything is all right and we can move forward so click the next button it is checking once again okay then close this now just click on finish button and here and here it is the profile is loading so now you will see your email addresses email sorry email here here it is so as you can see that now we have successfully configured our gmail okay so this is how you can configure your gmail in outlook 2010 or 2010 thanks for watching this video